This is a case of an incidentally detected developmental venous anomaly, or DVA for short, on a follow-up brain MR for an arachnoid cyst in a 38-year-old female. The first two images demonstrate linear hypo-intense signal coursing through the deep and periventricular white matter of the right frontoparietal region on the susceptibility-weighted sequences. On the T2-weighted sequence, there is corresponding linear T2 hyper-intense signal at the DVA. The post-contrast T1-weighted sequences demonstrate linear enhancement with extension towards the subependymal veins on the right. Two mildly dilated subependymal veins are demonstrated on the right on the final post-contrast image. A DVA results from a network of dilated medullary veins radially, radially converging on a large vein that drains into deep or superficial veins. The DVA is usually surrounded by normal brain parenchyma and are thought to arise from prenatal occlusion of a vein draining into the deeper superficial venous system. Because the DVA represents a compensatory venous drainage pathway for normal brain parenchyma, sacrifice of this pathway during surgery can result in venous infarction.